Well, I say we go ahead and start a discussion and Sorry. we can interrupt for the swearing in. It's 5.30, what do y'all think? Sounds good. Mr. Chairman. I'm not the chairman. This is big dog. Yeah, yeah, big Brian Powell's not. If I want to do any changes to the uh, committees? Well, they're ex officio. I'm good where I'm at. I'm good where I'm at. I'm fine where I'm at, but if anybody wants to switch, then... That's kind of the way I feel. If anybody wants finance, they're welcome to it. I'm open to uh, taking on... I'm texting. <laughs> yeah. I'm serious. If anybody's interested in finance, I'll certainly uh, be glad to switch. We do it any time I don't think anybody hears Can you switch any time during the year, right? I think you can. Yeah. We did with a million Yeah. Okay. Yeah, can you switch if you don't make your switch? Time. I think you need to do it the first year and stick with it. Well, we're not making any changes. Yeah, I'll, take I'll take yours. Really? You want finance? Well, I will, yes. Okay. I'll you do can that. Have to. Uh, you want Jeff to take whatever health and sanitation. that's the only one you had in it. Mm -hmm. And you've got health and sanitation? Yes. Which is big this year because we're going to be redoing the waste contract. So you still want finance? You don't want health and sanitation? <laughs> I, don't mind, I don't mind switching and I don't mind taking on some more responsibility if I need to. So if he's looking to have less, then I'm just on the I'm just saying I'd be willing if, it, if someone wants it. So if you want it, it's fine to me. Be a vote. Okay. Is that a motion? Any other changes? So we'd need a motion. Y'all would need a motion. For all of them to kind of roll into one. For that change. Basically keeping them the same as this, this past year, except Watson and Williams will switch. Yeah. I'll make that motion. That your committee do. But. Second. Okay. Okay. So all those in favor, and and that would be with no other changes, right? Right. Right. All the, all those in favor, please say aye. Aye. Can you oppose? Like sign. Okay. Good. All right. Uh, the second item has to do with this <clears throat> street light data access ribbon. Yes, um, this was in the budget for a data that will give us access to historical traffic data for all intersections, whether it's lit or not lit. I don't have to have guys sitting out there counting traffic, left turns, movements. So this, we can just draw a line on a map and get counts. So it's one year, one year membership. Well, you mean for council with recommendation for regulation to pass. Good. All right. Further discussion? All right. If not, all those in favor of that motion, please say aye. Aye. Any opposed, like sign? All right. Thank you. Thank you. Item number three is for uh, professional services. Ben is in the planning commission meeting. Will you make sure he. Thank you, Mark. Angie's here. Too. All right. Item number four, we'll come back to three. Well, <laughs> Angie's over there. They're too. over there, too. <laughs> Item well, number. Kobe might get to go ahead. How about, how about six? On six. Furniture. Furniture. So we wanted to get uh, the council's temperature on something. Uh, we're going to be moving into the new building. There it is. We're going to be moving in uh, probably the end of March into the phase two of the criminal justice complex. Um, about half the furniture that we're going to be moving in there, we've been storing it over in the Masonic Lodge. And um, it's older furniture. And we're still on track and we budgeted for the bonuses to give our employees, the maintenance crew, and public works employees to move the furniture for us. But as Mayor and I were talking, it may, may be beneficial instead of in five years or seven years replacing the furniture, we can, we can use our buying power now. Uh, we'll have more leverage to get a better price now. Uh, it would be an easier move if we go in in five or seven years, or whatever it is, you're going to have to have IT come disassemble uh, 
move the old furniture back out, new furniture in, IT comes back in. We think we can all just, we can do it easier on the front end, so. Uh, but we'll get a better deal now than we will later on, whenever we buy this. So we just wanted to see if the council would entertain that. What, what do you do with the old furniture? We could auction it off. Maybe <coughs> there might be a possibility they would take it in on a trade. I don't know for sure. Um, but the 665 doesn't have any value to the old. No. No. Is the price not to exceed? Um, and specifically, which departments? And every department. It'd be every, all of phase two. Yeah, all of phase two. Every department has a mixture of new and old furniture. Which is all phase two is basically what? That's everybody except police, uh, police fire, yeah, street. You're going to have well, no. You get some. You yeah. Get, yeah, whenever you guys switch. Yeah. So city attorney would be getting new uh, furniture. You'd have city clerk, planning, engineering. Building inspection. Building inspection, neighborhood services, admin, HR. Uh, no judges. Court clerks, though. Yeah. <laughs> Not the judge. He's got me. <laughs> <laughs> court clerk. Hold on, ask a question. Yeah. So you, you deal with spring dog companies. Do all this stuff. That's great. Okay. This would be the same company that it be. Uh, oh, it's a Springo company. Um, and they're the ones that we bought all this other furniture from, and we'll buy the other half of the phase two's furniture from. So that's why we think we get better buying power anyway. And all that's the Springo company yeah. in our business. Yeah, this additional cost would basically be on top of what we were going to do, and this, this cost takes the old furniture out of the equation and just replaces it with new. So we're moving into a new building. Where would we have new furniture? furniture? Would we have a time to move in? So that's why you have this one now, because they need to know to get this ordered. If they're going to have it when we move. Yeah. I think it only makes sense. I'd like to move the resolution forward to council with recommendation for approval. Second. Further discussion? All right, all those in favor of that motion, please say aye. Aye. Any opposed the light sign? All right. Thank you. Uh, and then we're on item number three, <coughs> having to do with Dick's Lane, I guess. Not Dick's, yeah, Dick's Yeah, Dick's Lane. Uh, this is just a contract to hire driver engineers to do the construction inspection for the Dixie Lane Road uh, project, which we opened bids on and got approval handle last year. So you're saying we got approval last year. This is money somewhere? No, we got approval to build the road last year. This this will come out of bond money. This comes out of bond money? Yeah. This is the oversight for the construction. That's right. Yeah. Then is Garden a local company? Uh, they are local. They have an office in Fayetteville and they have an office in Rogers. How about Springdale? You get check. Springdale. They do not have one in the city limits. Can they get competitive? Or do we not deal with Springdale people at all? Or? No, we do. We Springdale's, do Springdale's gotten their, yeah. They got but we the do, we yeah. do let yeah. everybody gets a bid on that. There is no bid. This is a professional service, so you right. can't take price into consideration. You take a statement of qualifications. We, we have a committee that gets together, and we rate those qualifications, and we find, we rank them in priority of the most qualified. And that can change over time depending on workload and personnel, et cetera. So we start with this person and then we negotiate a contract. And if we can't come to an agreement, we move to the second most qualified. So that's how we acquire these services. I didn't know if you did. I didn't. I thought you did. I didn't know. Yeah. yeah. Things have changed. For engineering yeah. services, it's like our, we do architects the same way. Yeah. Okay. Engineers, architects, <laughs> yeah. Land appraisers. 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 Okay. Yeah. I move the resolution before the council for recommendation. Second. Further discussion? All those in favor of that motion, please say aye. 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 Any opposed, like sign. <coughs> All right, thank you. Museum. Angie's not here, but I can tell you what numbers four and five are. They are to appropriate money from insurance proceeds received across the hall. To repair the roof set 305 North Main and 307 North Main. It's just those transferring those insurance like money. Place? It's the two that we bought. It's just to fix the roof. From the hail. From the hail. And it's using insurance proceeds. So it's it. not really any money out of our pocket. No. 
Move the resolution be forwarded to the council for the recommendation. Can we, can we do that on Mother three and four? four. No, four and five. Okay. Four, four and five. Four. Four. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have a motion to forward both resolutions at four and five. Council with a recommendation for approval. Second. All those, any further discussion? All those in favor, please say aye. Aye. Any opposed, like sign? Walked in just a time, Angie. You, 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 you can talk us out of it. Yeah. <laughs> they just no, no, that's I think they've been. <laughs> they just forwarded both of them. Approved. Oh, it's out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All, All right. So that's the end of the You waited long enough. Um, <laughs> I haven't heard from Brian yet. I texted him. Uh, Young. Somebody else can take that, or y'all can go to Parks and Rec. But I, I, I got a feeling he's not going to be here. So you to swear in judge, you, if you want to take, if they want to, you so can far everything we've done has been illegal. Yeah. <laughs> I, I haven't been involved. Yeah. Okay. I guess we're in Where do you want to swear them in right here? But well, we're going to remain seated. Well, <laughs> you're going to stand. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You want to on one more. Right. Where is it? Can we have Parks, Parks and Rec and Parks. Oh yeah, we did. Just tell Brian he can seven come in. Seven and eight. That's what I'm saying. He's got do. seven and eight left, right? Seven and eight. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but that's not in finance. Right. right. So I think we're jumping back. To... I need to move to changing the finance and then he took finance. Yes. Did you notice that? Yes. <laughs> I just now caught that. That's okay. We'll I'm do not, it over here on the wall. Do I get to read it? Yeah, that's fine. Habits. <laughs> yeah, Mary, you're sorry about that. That's okay. I wasn't prepared for it. <laughs> All right. Can we do this separate or? No, let's do it all together. Okay. Don't raise your right hand. Don't pronounce our names. I won't. Repeat after me. I state your name. I solemnly swear, or affirm, or affirm, that I will support the Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the State of Arkansas. And I will faithfully discharge the duties of city council member the duties of city council member. State the ward in position. Ward in position. That's all right. We're moving on. <laughs> For which I'm about to end. For which I'm about to end. Said term begins January 1, 2023. Said term begins January 1, 2023. And ends December 31, 2026. <laughs> item number seven, uh, chief having to do with uh, funds for equipment. Yeah, what we're asking for is to use Act 833 money, so our dedicated fund to, to purchase some computer equipment that will allow our locution, which is a station alerting uh, software program. To work and not tie up a dis dispatch console for the radio portion of the transmission. Uh, we worked with Chief Peters to 
upgrade so that all of our dispatch positions are able to dispatch police and fire. We think it's important uh, that they can all do that uh, at EMS. Uh, and this piece would uh, allow us to use all of those for functional dispatching and not tie up uh, a, a physical dispatcher position console during our automated dispatch process. I'd like to forward the resolution to council Okay. So what is the 833 fund? Uh, that is money that we get, basically it's a turn back money from the state that's allocated through county. So we get Benton County and Washington County Act 833 funding. It's uh, only allowed to be used for specific fire department purchasing. It, it's, not, it's more broad than dispatch though, it's for other things? Yes. I think, we've, I think we've gotten ambulances, haven't we? Yeah, we've got you know, stuff for training. And what is the balance of that? <coughs> Roughly, you got about 400000 in there. So it's not using up the funds? No. no. And that's, is that done, is that replenished once a year or is it on a monthly basis spread out? Or I think it's every, every month. I think they get a smaller deposit in there. Okay. I think it, I think so it bills during the year? Something yeah. like $180,000 a year. All right, we have a motion and second forward. Uh, all those in favor of that motion, please say aye. 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 Can you oppose, same sign. All right, thank you. Close, uh, please and fire. All right, I'll open up Parks and Rec. We've got one item tonight. Uh, I'll go ahead and read it and I'll turn it over to Ben, looks like. Uh, a resolution authorizing the mayor and city clerk to approve a notice of additional services, Speckman Mossop, Michaels for water and sewer improvements related to Luther George Park project. So, this may be the smallest change order I've ever brought to you. It's $4,750, and what it's for is the redesign of the sewer line. So, they put a sewer line in, or <coughs> planned on putting a sewer line in, uh, and then putting a mound on top of that sewer line. And so, then they were going to wrap the sewer line around the mound, and then they went back and decided that they could do it casing and leave the sewer line under the mound and that's going to save tens of thousands of dollars and it's going to cost us four thousand seven hundred fifty to make that redesign so this because we were out we were all planning on paying for that out of uh rescue plan, or not rescue plan ARPA. arpa funds for the moving of the sewer line so we're not going to have to do that now well, they're going to upsize the sewer line to to they're still going to upsize so it. So they're still going to upsize it. There's still going to be a fees associated with it, but it's not going to be as long, and it will be cheaper than originally. Okay, good. Planned. That and that's we've still got an agreement with Springdale Water. We do. They're going to share that cost with us. We just don't know the amount yet, but right. it'll be less than what they first talked about. Uh, yeah, I think originally we've got an agreement for two hundred seventy-five thousand. Mm -hmm. It'll be some some number less than that. Okay. Is there any reason why the water server don't do their own engineering on it? We usually use the same engineer so that there's not a conflict between what they want to do and what our engineer designs, uh, and that's why we end up with the same one. But it's part of the reimbursement that we'll get back from them. Oh, okay. Is so, this a new yeah. line? or is No, it's an old existing 8-inch line that crosses Spring Creek and goes through Luther George Park, and it's still going to do that, but it's going to be upsized to a 21-inch line for the area that's under the mound. And that's why it's, uh, it'll, it'll be eligible when we... When we do come to you to spend the money for the actual work, it'll be eligible for our performance. Feeds toward the old labor camp. Hmm? That line feeds toward the old labor camp. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm going to move on. Any other questions or action? Move uh, this resolution before the council for recommendation. Second, I got a motion and a second. Any other comments? All in favor say aye. Aye. All opposed, same sign. All right, with that, we'll close Parks and Rec. All right, I do have one question for you. We were talking today, uh, Colby and Anna and I, we went through the new phase, the, we got an update on the new building, the phase two. Walked through it, wondered, uh, I know I had talked with some of y'all about maybe doing that right after Christmas. Would y'all be interested in walking through that They've got sheetrock up now, and they're, you know, it's really getting along now. And uh, uh, we could do it, if 
y'all could come earlier next Tuesday before the council meeting, like about 4.30, okay. then we could meet and go through it. Y'all interested in doing that? We'll go ahead and get it set up yeah. okay. for all y'all that can make it, and it'll send something out to you. Okay. Okay, good deal. That's all I got. Thanks. Thank you. And I'll uh, try and get our other council.